in this question, we'll look at uh, four different types of prompt engineering, uh, which are uh, zero shot prompting, few shot prompting, chain of thought prompting, and finally, self consistency prompting. Uh, let's discuss them one by one. Uh, first is zero shot prompting. It is a prompting technique that involves generating text without any training on the specific task at hand. Instead, the generative AI system uses a pre-existing language model trained on diverse tasks to generate text for a new task without additional training or fine tuning. And if you think about it, this has a huge benefit. Zero short prompting allows for quick and easy adaptation to new tasks without requiring large amounts of task specific training data. This is what it looks like. The next is few short prompting. Few short prompting is a technique uh, in which a model is trained to perform a specific task with limited or few training example, hence the name few short prompting. In few short learning, the model is uh, fine tuned on a smaller data set of examples, often referred to as a short. This is done to learn the underlying patterns and rules of the task. The model is then tested on a separate data set called the query set to evaluate its performance. Few short prompting can be helpful when the data available for training is limited or costly to obtain. This is what few short prompting looks like. The next is chain of thought prompting or COT prompting. This allows the model to achieve uh, complex reasoning through middle reasoning steps. What do I mean by that? At its core, chain of thought prompting is about guiding the LLM to think step by step rather than just giving a direct output. This is achieved by providing the model with a few short examples that outline the reasoning process. The model is then expected to follow a similar chain of thoughts while answering the prompt. This is what a chain of thought uh, prompting looks like. All right, finally, we have a self consistency prompting. This basically builds on chain of thought prompting. Self consistency aims to replace the naive, greedy decoding uh, used in chain of thought prompting. Uh, just imagine you are trying to write a story one sentence at a time and each sentence is based on the previous one that you may have written. The way you are doing it right now is to write the next sentence without really thinking too much about how it fits with the previous one. That's what we mean by naive greedy decoding. Now self consistency is like a smarter way to do this. It means that when you write each new sentence, you are paying more attention to make sure it fits well with what you have written before. It's like checking if your uh, new sentence makes sense and matches the story's tone and style. Self-consistency involves uh, providing the AI model with multiple reasoning paths or uh, diverse perspectives and then selecting the most consistent and coherent answer among the generated responses. This technique not only helps uh, to reduce biases in the AI's responses but also encourages it to consider various viewpoints before arriving at the conclusion. So that's all about uh, types of prompting. Uh, if you guys have any doubts uh, till now, let us know in the comment section below and we'll get back to you.